Oscar coach was telling us he liked the uh, the edge at practice today. He kind of felt like the guys had a good edge to him. Oh, 100 percent. Yeah, guys were flying around. We had a little bit more physicality today, first day of pads, and we, we had a really good practice. It sounds like the physicality has been up really since fall camp started. Have you noticed a difference in that way compared to previous years? 100 percent, and the coaches have too. And we, we had a couple comments saying that this is the most edge that we've had as an offense, and, and we're really excited about it. Go show. Kansas State this year. So when you guys are, are, are going and maybe the offense wins a play and defensive coach lights up those th those guys on that side, how healthy is that kind of stuff with that mentality in fall camp that the season's on the way? It's real healthy. Uh, we always like to say iron sharpens iron, so we, we want to get each other better and, and whatever we have to do to do that, we're going to do it. Is there a reason you guys wanted to be a little more physical in fall camp this year or that there's been a difference that you've noticed? Uh, that's just our brand. That's our culture. But, um, whether we lose guys or don't, we, we always want to be physical on, on defense and, and great on, on offense. Is there any balance there of, you know, you want to be physical and you want to get those reps in, but you also don't want to wear yourself down as a group? How do you guys sort of find that, that balance? We take care of each other. We, we know that we need to get better each and every day, and, and we need to be physical with each other, but at the end of the day, we're a team. Coach Trailer has mentioned that part of that is maybe wanting to have a little bit more of a sense of urgency for the non-conference season, maybe get some better results in September. Is that something that you guys have talked about? What do you see from that? Yes, we, we usually start a little bit slow, so we're trying to, we're trying to up the, uh, the the level right now and, and trying to be a little bit more physical right now to, to where it leads up into Kennesaw State in those uh, non-conference games. What else has to be different to get the results that you guys want in those games? Just a lot more passion right now. Um, we lost a, a couple guys, we lost uh, some leaders, and we need those guys to step up, including myself. We've talked through the off season about your sort of improved fitness level and the way you wanted to come back and attack this season. How has it been getting on the field in a fall camp setting? Have you noticed a difference? Yeah, I've noticed a, a, a big difference. My speed's a little bit better. My, my routes are a bit better. My strength's still there, so so my blocking's still really good. So I'm really excited to see what I can do this year. What have you noticed from the other guys in the tight end room? Young but really talented. Uh, we we have some some really good guys, Houston, Dan, and uh, and Pat and Dev. They're going to be really good, and I expect them to see the, the field this year. Do they bring kind of different dynamics or stand out in different ways, or are they similar type of players? Yeah, I mean, everyone's unique. Um, everyone everyone can run block, everybody can uh, pass block, everybody can run routes, but we're all a tight end group, and, and we do what we need to do to, to win ball games. When you mention that it's a young group, how do you try to bring them along? What's kind of your leadership role within that? Just keep, just keep uh, pouring into them. You know, sometimes they're gonna have some mistakes, and and I and I mistake sometimes too. And and I let them know that it's okay, and and you just gotta flush it and, and move on to the next play. All right, sure. thank Thanks, you, Oscar. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.